Hi, and welcome to the first episode of the Charger Bulletin Podcast. I'm Matt DiGiovanni. And I'm Dendra Abdenor. To start things off, we're going to talk about the homecoming. Blue out, blowout is coming. Uh, this means football's back. That's uh, the first year that UNH has football after a really long time of not having football. Um, on September 26th, um, at North Campus is where it will be, and you can always check the Charger Bulletin for times. The football game starts at 1 p.m. sharp. Also, don't forget to go to the football game this Saturday, also at 1 p.m. at North Campus. All sooner this year, UNH has integrated an ROTC program into the curriculum. Students will attend one class per semester on military science. This past Friday, in remembrance of 9-11, USGA and students were invited together to remember 9-11. Clips from the documentary 9-11 were played, and Professor Marty O'Connor led the group in reflection and prayer. Students were also invited to sign a banner that will be uh, donated to either a 9-11 Remembrance Museum or to a firehouse. In local news, Yale student Annie Lay was positively identified after her body was found in the basement of a medical facility. The investigation will continue. Upcoming campus events include Bean House on Wednesday on the Student Center in Bartels. The show starts at 9, uh, but you better get there quick because science will end at 10. If you dance, if you sing, if you do any performance at all, you're completely invited to sign up. Additionally, for those interested in community service, this Friday there will be a beach cleanup organized by the ALD sorority. Just show up at Maxi Hall. Uh, there will be a bus leaving at 9 a.m. Also, for those of you with a little bit of dirty humor, Jim Spinato has an R-rated show this Saturday night at Dodge Theater at 10 p.m. Thanks for watching the first episode of the Charger Bulletin podcast. Be sure to check the Charger Bulletin website for updates at www.chargerbulletin.com. I'm Dendra Abdenor. And I'm Matthew Giovanni. Until next time.